Welcome to the Breadwinner Podcast. As always, I'm your host, Tyler Jack Harris. Welcome to the Sales Wolves Podcast. As always, I'm your host, Tyler Jack Harris, and I am a sales wolf. Uh, you do a lot of podcasts, not just here that you do podcasts. Uh, you also go on other people's podcasts and some of the stuff that I've looked at and we've been doing editing for. How is it different now? What are, what are the steps that you're having to take or other people having to take? Um, like for instance, I saw one that um, you obviously did live, uh, in, well not live, but in person there at that location. Um, I know you recently did, uh, you were at a radio station for one um, and you were actually in downtown Greenville and it was, it was in the morning, it was early in the morning, but at the same time, it was like a ghost town. What are, what are people doing now for podcasts to either get you on or what are you doing to get on people's podcasts now that the environment has changed a little bit with I mean, crisis? the podcast world in general right now is just wide open because again, people have more time than ever. Um, and people want to get their message out now more than ever because they know people are at home on their phones, on the computer, they're, they're consuming content like crazy right now. And so it's a great time for someone that's just starting a podcast today to reach out to someone that they may think is like untouchable and they may actually respond and say, yeah, I'll give you 20, 30 minutes. Um, you know, that's the whole reason I started the Breadwinner podcast is so that I would have a reason to have a conversation with someone that I just wanted to have a conversation with. You know, if I were to reach out to them and say, hey, you know, whoever, Andy Frisella, um, I love 30 minutes of your time on Thursday. What time works for you? Number one, they wouldn't respond. Um, he might, but they're probably not gonna do that. But when you say, hey, I've got this podcast, here's some of the previous guests, here's what we talk about, and I'd really like to pour in as much value as I could can into you and have your information and your authority reach out to a different audience, um, put together some graphics, you can do that easily on your own to make it look professional. And they're all of a sudden like, yeah, I can do that. And you're like, huh, cool. Then you have an hour long conversation with this person that you thought would never in your wildest dreams say yes. And it's just because you had a podcast that may be a day old. Uh, Andy Purcell is the first guest of my podcast uh, on the Bremen podcast. And so I think it's a great time to do that. Um, also, you know, the, the conversations have been more around opportunity and chaos how to take advantage of this time, how to handle the situation that we're in. Anytime there's relatable, topical, current uh, things that you can talk about rather than just the regular old, like let's ask these five questions and let's have a conversation around that. Making it more current um, is huge. But yeah, I mean, anybody out there that has a podcast, I mean, they should be quadrupling down right now on how many people are DMing and sending a Facebook message and an email, just inviting them to be on it because you're going to get twice as many people that say yes. Um, and that's, you know, that's what it's all about. And you can bank over this next 30 days, you can bank a hundred episodes, 50 episodes, 20 episodes that you release, you know, weekly or whatever their, their schedule looks like. And you've got, you know, the next half a year, year of podcasts uh, to release, which is, which is awesome. I probably should be doing more of it. We've just been, you know, we are an essential business that is still operating at a very, very high level. Um, so my time, I really don't have a lot of downtime, um, probably less downtime now uh, than before.